Hi, this is Deb from businessbuildingshortcuts.com and today we're going to talk just briefly about creating live or clickable links to your blog, website, or offer in the description of your YouTube videos. If you're not using videos to get your name out there to grow your list or to uh, send people to an offer, you need to start doing that right away. And the other piece of this is that you need to have links that are live in your description to make it easy for people to find you and to, to go to whatever place it is you're trying to send them on the internet. The first thing we're going to do is make an account setting change so that for sure you will be allowed to um, have live clickable links. So go log into your YouTube account I mean our business building shortcuts account right now and click on this little text link that says account. It's going to take you into your most recent video but also into your account and what you want to do is go over here to the right under more and click on edit channel. Here it's going to tell you your channel type and it's going to default to YouTuber and you want to change that channel type to one of these other descriptions and you want to find the one that's closest to you. Directors would be um, somebody who is doing entertaining and informing, show creators and personalities, eh, it's not really me, um, and you would find the one that's most like you. If you're doing musical things, a musician, if you're doing comedy sketches, if you're reporting on the news, if you're just teaching and informing you would want to switch it over to your guru type which is not that you're a guru but that you are teaching others particular skills or information. And then you would update your channel and that would be that. Then what you want to do is to look at how you enter your actual links in your YouTube descriptions. So let's go and check that out. All right, there are two ways you can access the description for your YouTube videos, and that is that little section that lives over on the right hand side when you're viewing a video. Um, let's go in and look at a video. This, this piece over here is your description. So the first place you can edit that is when you go into uploading a video file. So let's just go in and show you what that looks like. When you go into YouTube, it'll take you to this, and you would go select a video. I'm going to just go grab a short one so that you can see what uh, the place that I'm talking about. All right, I've navigated over to a video, an MP4 video that I've created, and it's also on our blog, showing you some interesting ways to use Password Corral to manage your data. So I would just select that and click Open. It's going to bring this little upload field. Um, up for you and you would be able to change the title but here is your description part and the thing that you want to do is enter into this description your clickable or live links. We always start with the link of the place we want people to go and the key is to use the HTTP colon forward slash forward slash. Now you can use the www as well or you don't have to but let's just say I want to send people back to our blog businessbuildingshortcuts.com I would start with that link and then I would go ahead and I would type in the description of the video and then I can enter in other live links as well but the thing is that you always have to put in the HTTP if you just use www business building shortcuts it's not going to be a live clickable link then you would enter your tags select your category and do those kind of things and upload the video this is already up there so I'm not going to upload it again but this is the first place you would be able to um, make your clickable links in this description now what we want to do is show you another way because if you've already got videos up on YouTube you're going to want to go in and edit them so that your links are live and clickable. So let's go do that. Okay, so here I am back at Business Building Shortcuts and I'm going to go into my videos and I want to go to my Create a Business email. That was our last video that we did. 
and so when you go to your videos it's going to bring you within your account to this section and what this will show you you can see you've got a live link there I've got two of them in there but what you'd want to do if you wanted to edit these because your links weren't live or you just wanted to change something about your description let's say that you didn't start with your URL but you want to now you would go ahead and go in open to each video click on it and then go to edit video and it will bring you to this where you can see your business uh, video title and then your description and you can see here that I've got HTTP businessbuildingshortcuts.com and then at the end I also have the HTTP www so that you could see that both of those were clickable now what I want to do to demonstrate this is I'm going to take out the HTTP and just have the www then when you've made those changes you would just click save changes and then to double check and see if your links are live you would click on the link that takes you to this page again and over here you can see and I'm going to open this up by clicking on more information and that will bring the whole thing to light now you can see that this is a live clickable link and if I click on this it's going to open up you can see I've done it twice let me close both of those for you so that we can see how it opens up I'm going to click here on this link and you can see that it's going to take me to that link to our blog now down here somebody would have to highlight that copy it and paste it so you can see the www by itself does not work you need the HTTP so I'm gonna go back in and the reason we put this first is that if you have a long description only so much of it is going to show on that initial page if some if the people who are watching don't click on less info on more information here they may not see a link that you have later on in your description so the first thing you want them to see is the link to which you want them to go as a result of watching that video and so put that in there first now I'm gonna go back in here and I'm gonna change that again to HTTP and we'll go in and save the changes and then we'll go back into video details here and click on create the business email that's how you get back to it from that screen alright we don't want to hear it playing we just want to look at the links alright so my HTTP business building shortcuts is a live link and my HTTP www is a live link also so those are just the two quick changes that you need to make update your uh, type of account from youtuber and then go in and make sure that you have the http in front of the links in your youtube video descriptions so go now and do those things if you don't have if you haven't done that already and have fun marketing your site and getting the word out there using videos